Hi, thank you so much for watching this video and I'm Grace here to do your weekly oracle card reading for March 30th till April 5th 2015. Okay, for today I am going to use, um, I'm going to draw one card from the Gaia Oracle deck um, by Tony Carmine Salano as well as one of my favorite decks the Angel Therapy deck by Dorian Virtue okay so I have shuffled the cards and I have laid the cards here I am going to do the big reveal okay so the first energy card of the week from totally from the Gaia Oracle sorry it is the nine of hearts and it states here fulfillment harmony and protection okay so I'm going to do um, I'm going to just reveal all the cards to you first before I go through everything okay so the first card we have here is goddess second card be willing to forgive third card you are a powerful light worker fourth card release Fifth card, vegetarian or vegan. Okay, so I am going to read to you the description for the Nine of Hearts, okay? And it states here, This card signifies success, emotional fulfillment and wisdom. Something that is dear to you or something that you are working towards has a positive outcome. This leads to a period of peace and harmony and a deep sense of personal satisfaction and emotional fulfillment. That which you strive to create and achieve is granted and all is protected along the way. The light shines upon you, all is blessed. You can move forward with confidence. Okay, so basically what I'm feeling for this card is that this coming week will be a week of success. Whatever projects that you are currently doing will be successful. And for the past few weeks, we have been moving towards self-love. Um, for some of you, you have quit your job, you have resigned from a career, and you've decided to take one step at a time to move into a new direction. For example, if you if you are into spirituality and healing, you have taken steps to actually um, achieve your goals and desires by going to um, spiritual workshops, um, going to tarot card um, courses or oracle card courses, um, really going in depth into your uh, your dreams like really wanting to achieve what you are meant to do here in life and of course this will lead you to a sense of um, achievement and peace and you'll feel really stable I'm feeling security stable and you just feel that everything is going so smoothly for you and congratulations for those who actually have the courage to step into changes and transition into whatever that you want. Yay! <laughs> okay, so um, I'm going to go through the five cards from the Angel Therapy deck. And the first card is Goddess, okay? So what I'm feeling around here is... Let me read the description for Goddess. Express your divine feminine energy, embracing its magical intuition and nurturing qualities. From this card, I am strongly drawn to this. Which looks like the moon or the sun. And um, it's orange in color, like what I'm wearing. Um... To me, it's about sacral chakra, it's about creativity, it's about your emotions. So, what I'm feeling is that you have taken steps to achieve um, 
to your goals and your desires so please do not give up it's not a time to give up yet okay you will have to concentrate on using your rational mind be grounded instead of really um, using your emotions allowing your emotions to control you during this time because astrology wise from what I've seen from other videos there is a sense of um, ego coming up so you may have to not say suppress it but you have to accept your ego's um, thoughts and suggestions uh, and really give it some attention like um, you affirm yourself with yes ego I have heard what you are saying and I recognize what you really want from me but I would love to choose peace and love um, in this journey and I would like for you to join me like something like that um, really get yourself into a peaceful mood um, not getting distracted from anything else and really dive into all the unconditional love that it is okay really embrace your magical intuition and nurturing qualities that is the best you can do to achieve your goals okay so the second card be willing to forgive and what it states here ask the angels to clear your mind and body of past pain in exchange for peacefulness okay so again what I'm feeling is emotions this is emotional attachment so um, please do ask Archangel Michael to help you cut your cords to anything or anyone that has affected you from the past or in the present and really shield yourself from all the negative and lower thoughts and emotions really um, feel your success okay visualize your success and nothing else is going to stop from getting what you want okay um, so really clear your mind and body cancel clear delete remember um, do the Doran virtues method okay and really affirm yourself affirm your body I invite peace into my body into my energy field into my auric field I invite peace okay using the Gabriel Bernstein method I think it works because it works for me um, you can leave a comment below if it works for you too because I have tried it personally and it really really works okay so the third card here is you are a powerful light worker and it states here it is safe for you to be powerful your spiritual power brings great blessings and loving service to the divine really in order to attain your goal you must focus on your goal so your goal is love okay whatever career that you are achieving really think about your goals and for those of you who wants to attract your ideal partner for those who are single really focus on love okay and um, be positive always stay at a very high vibrational frequency in order to manifest all the positive things in your life okay So the fourth card we have here is release and it states here work with Archangel Michael to let go of what no longer serves you or your purpose. This card just flows so smoothly. It's like be willing to forgive and then focus on love and then asking you to release. You have to release your past in order for you to be really present in your present present situation okay so call upon Archangel Michael to help you get rid of all the lower and negative energies work with crystals if you would like if you believe in them I personally love my beautiful beautiful um, amethyst crystal it helps to raise my vibrational frequency as well as my beautiful elastic quartz 
Elastil Smoky Quartz. I meditate with it and it's awesome. And Elastil Smoky Quartz, when put together with maybe Rose Quartz or Amethyst or Clear Quartz, it heightens the vibrations and it's really, really powerful. So I really do advise and recommend that you get some crystals to help you with releasing um, your negative thought patterns as well as all of your past um, emotional ties. Um, one good uh, crystal that I recommend for relationship emotional healing is um, Rhodochronite crystal. Um, it's pink in color and if you wear it as a bracelet, it really really helps you to aid in emotional healing. You can also get a small tiny crystal and put it at um, your heart chakra or your um, sacral chakra. It really helps you to cleanse it and get you in balance again. Okay? So the last card we have here is vegetarian or vegan. Fresh organic fruits and vegetables give you a boost of high life force energy which elevates your spiritual frequency. So your diet is very very important these days so do not neglect your health when you are trying to achieve your goals and desires. Okay, dieting is a very bad form of slimming. Okay, um, please do not take any um, slimming pills or um, slimming patches or go for um, hormonal or hormonal pills some are some have negative side effects on you especially those of you who are really sensitive to um, energies um, because this um, this medicine will just affect you um, subtly or really strongly um, depending I just feel like um, this medicine are not going to help you. So exercise is key. Really get into the mood to exercise. Motivate yourself to exercise. Um, drink more water and really eat more fruits and vegetables to detox yourself, detox your body of all the negative and lower energies. This is what I'm hearing and this will help you to purge out all of the unwanted things in your energy field as well as your your physical body. It helps you to cleanse your mind, body and spirit and it's really great. Um hmm, I am um Okay, I'm being shown cucumber and tomatoes especially. I don't know if it makes sense to you, but I think these are um, the two highest um, vegetables in order to elevate your vibrational frequencies. You can try it. Okay, um, just eat more fresh fruits and vegetables. It doesn't necessarily have to be organic, okay? You just have to maintain um, your hydration, hydration level, sorry, and really be mindful of your health while trying to achieve your target, your goals, okay? So that's that, okay. Um... So I wanted to share with you something like past few nights I have been dreaming a lot and I couldn't get to sleep so I had some insomnia and really lavender helps me to, to sleep. Lavender is a beautiful scent. I love this. It's not too strong. It isn't too flory and it really helps um, aid you to sleep. So for those of you who are insomniacs, um, you may want to try a lavender essential oil, a lavender um, or the toilet perfume and um, also soak your feet 
into warm water um, for about 15 minutes it really helps um, your blood to regulate circulate around your body uh, it helps to detoxify as well and the lavender will help you to calm your mind soothe your thoughts and another thing to note is to be present in your own body in your own room the physical world um, when you are about to sleep okay um, do not worry about the future do not think about the past but really stay in the present moment okay really just breathe okay when you breathe uh, you must hear your breathing okay like like that I don't know if the mic can catch me but you must breathe um, in order for you to stay in the present moment okay um, this really helps a lot and I really do hope that this helps and I really thank you for watching this video once again you guys um, thank you for my new subscribers um, thank you for those who commented on my videos as well as um, liking them I really do appreciate all of this this little things means so much to me you have no idea and um, if you like this video and find that um, your friends or family need this insights and guidance into their lives, please do not hesitate to share them. I really appreciate this. And also, please feel free to visit my Etsy shop. I am providing readings, full in-depth readings right now. So I do hope to connect with you soon and see you. Bye!